We're now going to use a new option inside of version 10 which is the apply many manager and this allows you to create an MTF file and to apply it to each of our curb returns in one go. So to get into the MTF manager we go to design apply apply many manager. We want to select the model curb returns. When we select the model you'll notice that uh, the panel fills out the various curb returns that we created with the horizontal and vertical geometry. We now want to just select a view to display the results in which will be our design view and down the bottom here we just want to add the curb return template to the left hand side of each of the curb returns. So we can do that by right clicking on the top, clicking on browse and selecting curb return. We also need to select the tin that we're going to interface to. So we can just right click on that, select browse, and select ground, and then we hit create update. If I now just open up my design view and we zoom out, you can see that, and I'll just turn off our widening min and maximum, you can see that the cul-de-sac head has been created and interface with the ground the same with curb return number one and curb return number two so this is a very quick and easy method for creating multiple MTF files and applying them to an alignment string we could have done this also for road one and road two we can finish on this panel now if you wanted to create any modifiers for our various curb returns here once again you could just go back into your MTF file by selecting one of the sections or strings and you have the standard modifiers left and right side panel.